Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today we are watching episode two of Jujutsu Kaisen, uh, which is called For Myself. Uh, we know in the last episode it left off where um, it looked like he was being controlled by whatever demon that was that he ate the finger of. And um, and it looks like he was about to get offed by the jujutsu uh, people, and it's it seems like it's mostly because they're afraid that the other thing that is inside of him, uh, the curse demon thing, is going to take over, um, and that's a little bit scary. So let's jump right in. Right, so it's picking us back up at where he was like, I'm gonna exercise you because you're a curse. <laughs> See, he fought it. Oh, that's the guy we saw at the end of the last one. I was playing on coming. <laughs> Oh, that's the one that's <laughs> what is he doing? That's the one that sent him to go get the cursed object. Sightseeing, you fool! I <laughs> he said, "I stopped by while doing some sightseeing." And he's like, "I ate it." <laughs> It combined with him. Once 10 seconds are up, come back to us. Oh man. So is he about to, he's about to let the, what's his name, Sagund? Saguna? This man went out to get some, some sweet treats. He went to boss souvenirs while people were dying. Oh, he let it come out. Sukuna. That's a little scary. He's talking about this pastry while fighting him. He said, give him 10 seconds. So I'm going to show off a little. <laughs> and then he's like, no match. Can he read his movements? Sorcerers. Eight, nine, should be time. Oh! He did it! Who the hell is this Itadori brat? He's stronger than the 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 cursed guy. He's kind of annoying. <laughs> He's putting him to sleep. What? He just pulled a Sasuke on us. If he isn't possessed by Sukuna when he wakes up. He might have potential as of us. Oh, and we saw him wake up. We saw him wake up at the end of the first episode and he wasn't possessed. And then he's like, so which one are you? Is it going to be executed? Nah, nah, he is central. We need him. Allow me to... You're being executed. What? I thought he said he was going to... <laughs> the recap in the current doesn't add up. The execution's still on, but I got your senses suspended. This is the same as the curse object you ate. There are 20 in total. We possess six of them. Four arms? Four arms? 
Oh. Do they need him to retrieve the rest of those fingers? When you die, the curse inside of you will die as well. Oh. If we're going to kill you anyway, why not kill you after you've absorbed Sukuna? What? So they want him to go and find all of Sukuna's parts, absorb them so that they can kill him off easily because if they kill him, all, the, the curse dies as well. But they will also kill him before if he decides not to do that. So regardless, he's dying. I also love this opening. The music is really great. And it's showing us so much, but I don't I don't know what any of it means, but it's showing so much. I guess as we go, we'll we'll know. Why his body meshed so well with the Sakuna curse. Because it has to do it has to be something with like his parents. Like he has to his parents might have had curses or were curses. Oh man. But he hasn't regained consciousness. Mm. It kind of is your fault, but like not really, you know. <laughs> but it is kind of. If he don't, it ain't enough grass back there for him to be riding around as much. It really ain't. She like how how you know? Does she not remember him being there? Mm. Oh, he was the one that f it draws other curses towards it. Remember that? How did he find it? How did he find it? Like he has to have some kind of curse energy in him, but he probably was born with it, which is why you can't detect it. Something, senpai? about to be a little rough on me gruesome is not something that i enjoy <laughs> choose your hell mm. does he have to eat all the parts It is, and you just swallowed it like it was nothing. <laughs> you gross. This is like evident of like evidence of like guys can really eat anything. Why he choose that like that moment to eat it? You know, like why you didn't just go somewhere safe? Oh, it's so nasty. <laughs> He was born with, I'm telling his parents were curses or something. Or his parents were like like him, like with the white hair guys, what do they call them again? Jujutsu sorcerers? He might become too strong that they can't, that they decide not to, you know. Tokyo. <laughs> you think this is looking good? <laughs> oh, he's changing school. But what about his friends? I wonder how far Tokyo is. You're the third first year. Only three. <laughs> There's the three students in his class. That 
that's elite if I ever did see it. Why all these special schools be like up in the mountains hidden away by all these trees? Oh, they use it as a base too. Hmm. I wonder if his immediate execution. So you're not the boss? <laughs> Why he slap his own? He pumps out his ass. <laughs> He's just popping out of his face. It's the disrespect for me. You'll be the first one I kill. Fierce imaginary god with four arms and two faces. King of curses? How unlucky do you have to be to come across the king of curses? <laughs> Good, because we need somebody that's gonna beat him. Because once he consumes all these fingers off the forearms, it's gonna be a little rough. What is he poking his little? <laughs> what is he doing? He, he's sewing cute little bears. You're just making dolls. I meant to girls like Jennifer Lawrence. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> he go lecturing people. Why these dolls is evil? Dolls infused with my curse. <laughs> this little fluffy thing just knocked him down. Beat up by a dog. I really came here because they, they told me I had to. <laughs> I was always better than most sports. But this is something only I can. the moment I stop to think. I got chills on my legs, on my arms. 
I guess he passed. Welcome to Jujutsu Tech. Oh, and then the doll punched him again. Huge. he'll be attracted to him because they're his. They're part of him. You think he'll be that nice? <laughs> I think that he will be that arrogant to think that once he has all his fingers, he'll be able to take over. He put them right next door to each other. Why are you in his room? <laughs> I knew he was gonna smash his head. Oh my god. They play too much. Is it a girl? Is it a girl? It's always a girl. Like, I don't think I've ever watched an anime where there wasn't one girl on the team, on the main team. Is this the closing? <laughs> this is such an odd closing. Get it, get it, get it, move it. Oh, 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 I just got him jamming out. What is this? Oh, oh, oh. He come in super smooth. I guess it's showing the different personalities. The third person, yep, it's the girl, yep. She come in with bags. We got another Nami on our hands, shopping, eating. <laughs> oh, <laughs> him. Who is that? I wonder who the blue hair person. The panda again. The panda. What do we? <laughs> what do we go see? What this panda got to do with anything? Let's see. So they're gonna meet their their third. It is the girl with the short hair. Girl of steel. I wonder how strong she's gonna be. Um, because the other first year already seemed pretty strong, and then it's. Him, I forget his name because I'm really bad with names. And then it's Itadori, and then it'll be the girl of steel, whatever her name is, with the short hair. So yeah, I'm super excited. I really hope that you guys are excited as well. Make sure you come back here for episode three of Jujutsu Kaisen. And if you would like to check me out on my social media, I do have a TikTok and an Instagram. And if you would like to support this channel, please consider checking out my Patreon. That is always linked in the description below. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I suppose I will see you guys next time. Bye.